And he instructs us to be holy as he is holy. Not the form of godliness, but be holy as he is holy. We were in church one Sunday, Pastor Ann, and the Lord gave me a song. And I don't get many songs like that in the middle of service. But then it just started to roll out, and I started singing, Holy
Christ is risen. Oh yes, he is risen indeed. What a blessing to know that. What a blessing to live in that. What a blessing to deposit your faith in that. The fact that our Lord Jesus, who died on the cross, is no longer dead, defeated death, the grave, hell, he rose, and he's alive today. Wow, we can praise God for that right now. Good morning to you, good afternoon, good evening to all of you. You are welcome to this time of prayer. We encourage you to like and to share and to comment and to subscribe to what we are doing. Your comments should reflect this at least. He is risen indeed is the response, proper response to Christ is risen. Also respond with an I am statement. I am ready, listen, to lead us into prayer as we pray uh, today. Also, uh, name at least one thing the Lord has done for you today. Name at least one thing the Lord has done for you today. Listen, um, on this day, we're going to be praying for unemployment and those who may have lost a job, financial issues. We're going to read scripture uh, coming out of uh, Acts chapter 26. No, excuse me. It should be Luke chapter 15, verse 24, I believe it is. Luke chapter 15 verse 24 on this Friday and we are praying for those who are unemployed and who have lost wages during this time some say the economy is good but it's not good for everybody there's some folks that are still going through and struggling and we want to lift them today on this 20th day of August on this Friday all right Luke chapter 15 verse 24 let's read this scripture together then we'll do the model prayer together and then we will do the prayer starter from the book and then pray for those who are unemployed. The Bible says, for this is my son, was dead and he's, he's alive again. He was lost and is found. And guess what happened? They begin to be merry. They threw a party uh, in his name, in his honor. Amen, amen. Let's pray. Our Father, you are an awesome Father. Our Father which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day, thank you, our daily bread. Forgive us, Lord, our trespasses as we forgive those who have trespassed against us. Lead us not into temptation. Deliver us from sin and evil. You can do it for thine is the kingdom. Yes, you have the power, the glory, the honor in Jesus' name. We repent, Lord. We return to you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for receiving us with open arms. You are that kind of Father. <laughs> when we have messed up, when we have distanced ourselves from you, you always there waiting with open arms. Matter of fact, Lord, sometimes you close the gap in by coming to us, and we appreciate your grace over our lives, your mercy, God, your love, your benevolence, your kindness, toward us in Jesus name Lord as we pray today we've committed to praying today for a financial breakthrough we've committed to praying today for someone's job and situation to improve someone without a job looking Lord open the door for them to find Lord for someone who is employed but maybe somewhat underemployed I pray for promotion uh, next level for them Lord Someone, Lord, who's at a place, maybe they don't fit. And though they're making good money, it's causing stress, uh, mental anguish. It's uh, causing weight and division upon the family. Lord, I pray for all of that to be resolved today. Lord, I pray for someone who maybe is making a good salary, but just not handling it well. Maybe too materialistic. Maybe just not trained and disciplined uh, in putting some things away and saving God. You've given us so many lessons in scripture on how to deal with finances. Or even a believer who is just not trusting you enough with their finances and yet bringing a curse upon their finances because they have not chosen to trust you in the tithe, the offering, whatever it may be, God. Lord, I just also pray for friends who have plenty to be a blessing to those who 
have little. God, I pray that we remove the, uh, the stingy gene that is in us, the selfish gene that is in us. Sometimes it only makes us think about ourselves and we hardly ever think about anyone else. God, I pray that in the name of Jesus right now, Lord, give us benevolent spirits as you are, God. Give us uh, big hearts, Lord, as you have for us, God, in the name of Jesus, God. Lord, I'm praying for employers to be fair in their hiring practices, God. Thank you for those believing employers, those believing company owners, even in corporate America, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Pray for them not to be so materialistic and worldly, only looking out for themselves or that top small percent and yet overlooking, uh, can't even give a living wage to those. Lord, I'm praying for raises and promotions. I'm praying for increase in the name of Jesus. But Lord, we're not worried because we know you are the one that gives seed to the sower, bread for food. You are the one that supplies our need according to your riches. Lord, we trust in you and we believe in you. In Jesus' name we pray. I pray now for those on the other end of this prayer, God, those who are praying with me and praying together God that we not give up praying that we not give up petitioning that we not give up interceding that we not give up praying you said to pray and not faint Paul said to pray and do not cease to pray may we continue to pray Lord when we see the results pray when we don't see the results have faith and continue to pray to be patient Lord we have seen you work it out before why would you not work it out now Lord you don't always work it out the way we want you to but Lord, help us to believe and accept that even. In Jesus' name, we pray. Hallelujah and amen. Bless your saints. Thank you for hanging out with me, closing out this prayer week. It's Friday. It's the beginning of a weekend. Listen, be careful. Be wise. Pandemic is still raging out there. So do your due diligence as well. Hey, I love you with the love of the Lord. Hugs and kisses to you all. Bye-bye. everybody get on your feet come on and put your hands together this song is called excuse me look at your neighbor and say you don't know you don't know what's behind my dance why shout so loud why lift my hands you don't know why feel like But you won't.